Hey everybody, welcome to my uh, games uh, on the Xbox. Yeah, uh, we got a nice little game here that I've been wanting to let's play for a while. And uh, yeah, we all know this game. It's it's very classic. It's got that classic character feel, you know, like Frank West. He's a total badass. It's Chuck Norris of video games. Let's just be honest here. But uh, yeah, uh, this game's been out for a while. I think, uh, let's see, 2006. Yeah, it's been out for a long time. Um, yeah, it's made by Capcom. And uh, yeah, welcome to Let's Play Dead Rising. Let's get started. I love this game. It's been a favorite of mine for a long time. Alright. 72 hour mode. Now, the thing about this Let's Play is, is I'm going to start out at level 50. And I'm also going to have the Mega Buster. I'm sorry for you purists that want to see the the whole like feel of being in danger. Which, for the most part, you are in danger. Even with the Mega Buster. You can still be killed pretty easily. This game is not for the faint of heart, it's pretty tough. There's the man. <laughs> uh, I forgot to change my outfit. Yeah, well. Say, buddy, you mentioned something about research for a story. That's right. Got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that? They sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> That's right. He's Frank West. Yeah, laugh it up, fuzzball. Why wouldn't things happen in a small town? They always do in the movies. So why not video games? And in real life. She is. <laughs> Willamette, Colorado. Population 53,595. Remember that number. Distinguishing characteristics. Jack shit. <laughs> they don't make fun of that guy. I know him. The only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. Sure though. Young ladies love that place. Oh man, the military. What was that? The army? No, it was a traveling clown group. Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. All right, listen. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes roping it off. Take me over the main street. Now we're about to come up to a, a really neat part of the game. It starts off like you, uh, well, you'll see. <clears throat> Gotta love those loading screens. Alright, so now we've got, we're in camera mode here. Camera mode. So what's that? You can zoom in with the B button. Let's take a picture of that. Sure, why not? We got some PP. Pee PP. -pee. Pee -pee. Yeah, last game had some prey points. PP -pee points. And this one will too. Nice. Poor little loner zombie. Whoops, I spoiled it. They're zombies. Let's go ahead and take a picture of this. Well, I took the picture at the wrong time. Basically, what you want to do is you want to try to get their face in the shot. They said brutality, it's... Wow, that dude's really clobbering those zombies. Just going to take another one here, see if I can... Yeah. Now, the, the thing about PP is, uh, it's pretty much your experience. You unlock moves and stuff. Let's take a picture of him while he's like freaked out. Okay, we didn't get no genre because we already took the picture. But yeah, this is a pretty bleak, bleak scene. He's getting devoured already. <laughs> I wonder if they had like real actors like go out there and. Okay. Wow. This place has been overrun. Oh, whoops. I meant to zoom in there. Not bad. Yeah, sure. Let's take it now. 
so you can get a lot of PP even if you don't have like a genre. <clears throat> but that's not you always kind of want a genre. Genre. Let's see what else we got here. We should have some more action up ahead. Scallops. Okay. Tornado. Oh, that's that's kind of funny. Look at that dude. You want a mustache rod? Whoa! Perfect. Yeah, take a picture right there. You'll get a, a crap load of BP. I mean PP. PP. Oh, hey. Zombies burning. Yeah. Didn't take her up too high. I'm afraid of heights. Take us down. We have to check out that building. What's going on at the CW factory where they make all those hit TV shows like Supernatural? And, and the Vampire Diaries. Seems like everything is science fiction these days. And it's got to do with vampires and... Uh, don't get me wrong. I love Supernatural. It's an awesome show. I actually uh, watched a little bit of the Vampire Diaries because I'm like a huge Castlevania fan. And for some reason that... that if it's got vampires in it, I like watching it. But that show... It's just a Twilight ripoff. Anyways, enough bullshitting about a TV show. Let's get back to the game here. Oh, what? what, what. Don't exactly know when to take photos here, but. Oh, man, I think I missed that. Yeah, totally did. Oh! Okay. Apparently, the newspapers love brutality. The they love it. Take me there. Roger. Frank West, always the victim of his job. If anybody's going to do this job, though, it should be Frank West. Holy crap. Let's go there. Hey. Can you get me on the rooftop of that mall? You got to be kidding me. Man, you are nuts. All nuts. All right, listen. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. My name's Frank. Frank West. Sorry. Remember that name, because the whole world's going to know it in three days when I get the scoop. All right. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Holy crap. Aw, oh, what was that? It's probably like supplies and stuff. Drinking water and food and bandages and med kits and all kinds of crap. Get us back down to that rooftop. Guns and stuff. No, I'm going to get my butt chewed out for this one. <laughs> In more ways than one, especially if the zombies get you. We're going down. Sorry about the outfit, folks. At least he's not dressed up like Mega Man. That's generally how I play the game. Yeah, you're like, what, what, why, why would he be dressed up like Mega Man? Did you see that leap Frank did? Frank is a badass. He just jumps. He would. Jump out of anything. Hello there. Huh? Who's this guy? You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. No. You came alone. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, go on the battlefield alone, no crew. So, Badass. Uh, what's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? What did you see from the sky? 
Well, Back off, T Hawk. If it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. There's uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't Pull my finger? Like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if everyone's already dead. That's because they are, yeah. Chief. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. Well, it figures he's not going to tell us. This, my friend, is hell. Ooh, creepy. Yeah. Stiff upper lip, baby. Keep it. Keep it stiff. <laughs> that sounded so weird. <laughs> <clears throat> yep, Frank must be on the heliport at 12 o'clock p.m. on the 22nd, or he will be left behind in the mall. Pay careful attention to the time as you play. Press right on the D-pad, or left on the D-pad to check your watch. Pretty simple. Whoops. Now, one thing you'll notice is that the messages in this game go by with, like the blink of an eye. Sometimes it's very hard to read if you have a small television. Alright. <clears throat> so there's not a whole lot out here. So let's just let's just go in. Carlito is pretty much a mystery man at this point. We don't know much about him. We won't know much about him for a while. <clears throat> but that's okay. Now, saving. You can save your progress at locations marked with S, such as the sofa, sofa on the security room, in the security room, or the mall's public restroom. Uh, security room sofa or public restrooms. Pretty much that's where you can save in the game. So we're going to do that. Let's show you the save feature. Override existing saved game, yeah, sure. I was playing this a while back and just 100%ing it, but, you know. Now, I'm going to make this episode a little bit longer because we're just starting out and we need to learn some things. We need to do some things. You get out there. We need to find stuff out. We got a crap load of cutscenes anyway. Oh. Well, that sucks. She's pretty hot, too. Wow. What in the world? You know, for uh, an animated, like, video game character. Don't look at me like that. Oh, yeah. I keep thinking there's something in there, but there's not. Alright, let's see. Can we get... Yes, we can. Is there change clothes? Hmm. Where's the original clothes? Is the original clothes? Anyways, I never unlocked the the sword. So you know, whatever. Oh. <laughs> All right. Let's just let's go. I'll figure out the clothing situation next time. All right. Let's. See what we got here. Mega Buster's pretty awesome. Can't remember how to shoot it for some reason. Oh well. <clears throat> I better learn quick, right? <laughs> I'm gonna be in deep shit if I don't learn to shoot this thing. Oh look, it's a convict. <laughs> hey, 
Back off. God, you're annoying. Madonna? What? Why would you name your pet Madonna? Ooh. Hello. Hey, this is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. Man, this is the only time. What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? Um. Well, you got you kind of got a point there, old man. There's been more and more of them since last night. Now, they're all that's out there. Hey, look on the bright side. <laughs> what zombies. bright side? Stupid and slow. It's like you. We should be safe in here. Yeah, right. All right then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. I also need to turn off uh, notifications, which I will do in the next episode. How do I shoot this thing? I guess I can't right now. Anyways, I need to get stuff. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna have to blur those out, I guess. Anyways, and we got some people here. Really, no sense in talking to them. They're gonna die. Here's the crap we need to get. Oh, who's that? How are you going to stop me? What have I done? I didn't summon you. You don't look like an Aeon. Little Final Fantasy X humor there, just in case. Didn't understand that. It's not even really that funny. I don't know why I said it, but just weird that he says summon. Why did you summon me here? You know. Everything about that guy's weird. What are you, you wow, she she's like eighty years old and she's flinging young guys off of her like. Well, that didn't sound weird right either. <laughs> oh my God, what an idiot! Let her go. Close the door. Let her go and close the door. I, I hate to be that way, but this is the zombie apocalypse, people. Nobody does stupid crap like that and lives. Say look, she just released zombie hell upon us. Get over here. Everyone, move this way. Quick, to the stairs. Move. Okay, okay. All right, now I should be able to use the mega buster. Hopefully it's the X button that you use it with. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's get out of here. Now, jumping is your best friend in this game. And I know I already. Whoa! Oh, yeah, though. You can do that. <laughs> oh! Okay. Yeah. Luckily, I. Damn it! Yeah, you can also do that, which is very helpful. Yeah, there's no way. Just let it go. <laughs> Just run and get out of here. Huh? Oh, hello. Who's the blonde? Where are the others? I don't know. 
I hope they got away. Oh God. Uh, as long as those things are in the mall, we better not use this door. We better not use uh, this door. What are you doing? The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. They did a really good job of the voice acting on this game. You want to get back in there? What for? I mean, some of it's corny. But a lot of it's really good. He <laughs> did a double take to his left, like, like in some previous life. Or in, in his life. He pretty much just got blindsided on his left. He's like, I must look to the left twice As a for the rest of my life. <laughs> yeah, Frank West, porno, I mean, photo star, I mean, journalist, yeah. Yeah, let's check her out. Thanks, Capcom, for the gratuitous perv business. Who are you guys, anyway? And what are you... I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something? <laughs> Did he do something? No. Did he do it? Do some mo? Did he do it very slowly? Uh, if you hey, get that reference, I'll uh, love you forever. Just who are you guys? It's just an awesome reference. I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all Pitt? I'm authorized to tell you. No, he couldn't be Brad Pitt. <laughs> okay, so we've got pretty much 71 and a half hours after all those cutscenes and stuff. And uh, I'm going to have to stop it here. But pretty much uh, we, uh, we did a lot today. We got through a lot of cutscenes and now the gameplay will commence. And it's uh, very, very fun. So anyways, that's it for Let's Play uh, Dead Rising. Yeah, see you next time. Bye.